The polls have now been open for about a half an hour at the Expo Center, and we have been seeing record-breaking voting even as the coronavirus pandemic continues. Close to one million people have requested absentee ballots or they have already voted in person. Brooke is live at the Expo Center, which is the only polling place in Jefferson County. And Brooke, we have been seeing people really trickling behind you. Yeah, before six o'clock when those doors opened, we had several people, several hundred people crammed into that lobby there and they made their way in here pretty quickly. It doesn't look crowded because it's not. They are getting you in and out. The only line we're seeing are those people who might have requested an absentee ballot and did not get one in the mail. And that process is still pretty smooth, a little bit more time consuming, but you come here, they get you situated and you can still vote in person. And if you're concerned about the coronavirus, a lot of social distancing going on, plenty of PPE on hand, taking a Look, they had wiped down everything before anyone got in the building this morning. According to the governor's office, there are thousands of masks, about 5,000 for every county, 4,000 gallons of hand sanitizer, 5,800 face shields, and 20,000 gloves on hand for all 120 county polling places for both the voters and the volunteers if you want one. We aren't expecting to see complete results until at least June 30th. That is important for you to know if you see any of those results tonight. That's because early voting and absentee ballots still need to be counted and results available tonight will only be those in person votes. It will be a minority, a significant minority of the votes cast of the total votes cast. So any result that's that is released on election day is unlikely to be a result that anyone can think is even remotely close to being final. Now, polls opened again at 6. They will stay open until 6 o'clock tonight. If you are in line at 6 p.m., you still get to come through and make your voice heard. Also, if you have that absentee, uh, the absentee ballot still at home with you, your best chance is going ahead, filling that out and having it postmarked by midnight tonight. You can also drop it off at your polling location. But again, in the mail, if you can, is going to be the easiest way. And if you need help getting here, there are a number of options for you. First off, there is free parking here at the Expo Center for those of you residents in Jefferson. And county. There will be shuttles throughout the parking lots, making sure you can get to the doors with easy access. And then TARC is also providing free shuttles to and from its downtown headquarters every 30 minutes, making sure every voice that wants to be heard can make their way here and get a vote. If you are coming by transportation for yourself, you want to come through gates two, four or six. Those are the three gates that will be open and there are a number of signs showing you to this location. We are in the South Wing B uh, again, South Wing B at the Expo Center for those polling locations coming up and it'll be through uh, tonight again at six o'clock. We'll of course bring you live coverage throughout the day, but remember those results you see tonight will not be the official ones, guys.